Get easy. Easy like a Sunday morning. <sighs> Shouldn't do this at all. It's supposed to clean you properly, but never mind. Good morning there, folks. It is Sunday. I didn't really sleep much last night because it's been so hot. Uh, we don't have any air conditioning in this house yet. That is a future plan, hopefully. Uh, and none of the windows in the house actually open, except the windows on the doors, So and one window in the office, which is a little bit of a problem, but we will fix that at some point in the future as well. A lot of plans, but it is Sunday. Matthew is at work, obviously. I am hopefully going to speak to my parents in the next hour or so, but I'm just going to take the morning very chilled. I do want to go into the gym for a leg and ab day, maybe do a little bit of cardio, and throw in some chest rolls and triceps because I am a workout behind. But other than that, that is literally my day. We do some tidying. You probably do notice that we do the washing by hand, and we do have a dishwasher. Um, I am a bit afraid to use it because it is pretty old looking. We used to have a dishwasher in the old house, but it was pretty, pretty new. And the washer and dryer that was left by the previous owners were also very old and they broke within the first couple of months of us using it. So I am a bit wary to use it, so we do do a lot of the washing by hand. So I've got all of that to put away. Um, I might do a little bit of tidying today, who knows, but I'm just going to take it very easy today, very tired. Uh, and yeah, I'm going to catch up on some YouTube. I'm currently just making a cup of tea. And then yeah, I'm going to speak to my parents and then head into the gym. And it's going to be a very light day, just very high volume, but very light. And that's pretty much, I was going to sit outside in the sunshine, but we are due to get a storm today, it's supposed to chuck it down. I mean, it is sunny, but it, it's, it's supposed to, it's supposed to storm. Let's see if they're at home. Ooh. Hello. Oh, I just wait until about six o'clock and I'll give you a ring about six. Okay. Not time you'd have gone up this morning. Bye, love. See you later. Bye. Take care. And you. Bye. 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 Alright, so just finished spinking. Little spinking? I just finished spinking. <laughs> Can't talk on camera sometimes. I have just finished speaking to the rentals. I haven't spoken to them for a couple of weeks, so that was nice. Super excited looking, ah, oh, just all of the feelings that I can't even speak. Super looking forward to August. We've got Matt's mum and dad coming out, my mum and dad, and my sister and my brother-in-law coming out. Super excited. I have the whole month of August off, which will be nice, because it's their first time in Canada, so that'll be nice to kind of show them around. We're going to do a little bit of traveling, go to Calgary, and a lot of barbecues. Looking forward to it, but... Right now it is 10 past 12, uh, I'm going to grab a monster and head onto the elliptical for 10 minutes or so. I'm then going to do a little bit of foam rolling and some stretching because I never foam roll and I never stretch before going into the gym, I just warm up and then get on it. I'm going to head into the gym for a lower and upper day, I'm going to do a bit of mixed legs, calves, abs, chest, shoulder and triceps, going to do a little bit of everything. And Matthew is now ringing me. Hello. Hello. How are you? Fine, and you? Good, I was just rocking down to Electric Avenue. Fair enough. And then, we'll take it higher. Alright. Sorry if the camera's a bit shaky, my muscles are shaking. Uh, I've just finished up in the gym. I felt really, really good. I was down there for about an hour and a half, so that's pretty good. I did, because I was a workout behind because I missed yesterday's, I did a leg, 
an ab workout with a chest, shoulders and tricep workout as well. So I did a leg, then chest, then leg, then shoulders, then leg, then triceps. And just finished with three sets of 12 of crunches and three sets of 12 of laying leg raises. Laying, lying leg raises. And yeah, it's just, I felt really good. That monster really, really helped me get into the zone and sweat. But I've still got about half of it left. Um, I'm not normally an energy drink drinker, but that really helps me get moving and pumped because the basement's cold, so I don't normally sweat as much. But I was doing some thinking, and the last time I was on a structured gym program where I was losing weight and making progress in the gym was over five months ago. So it feels pretty good to be back in the gym. These first two weeks was a very steady, light workout. I was just trying to get my form and back into the muscle memory of moving the weights. So tomorrow, with it being bank holiday, it's Victoria Day, I will be going into the gym for a back and biceps and I'm gonna kind of reel in my program and give it a bit more structure and I'm also gonna rein in my diet and get better at eating healthy and sort of tracking my macros a bit better in, in doing this a bit better so hitting hitting these goals better. I'm gonna put this washing away, wash these and then I'm gonna make a protein shake and I'm then gonna head into the office for about 15, 20 minutes of cardio, pop on some YouTube videos. Fair enough, yeah it looks like it's going to chuck it down but It's always fun talking to yourself. I have just got out of a shower. That workout sufficiently pooped me. Um, I came up from the workout and I made that smoothie, which to be honest with you was absolutely revolting. I had to throw it away. It was disgusting. I don't know if it's because I didn't measure out the almond milk and I put two scoops of protein in, but it was pretty disgusting. I did come in here and attempt to start putting some of the crap away, but then procrastination and laziness came into play. And then Matthew texts me and they're having a barbecue at Prairie Soils or a smoker at Prairie Soils. So I'm still in my gym stuff because I don't own any clothes and it's like super warm outside and I'm just gonna head down to Prairie Soils. Matthew did, however, take my Jeep keys to work with him, so I'm gonna have to find the spur. Head down to Prairie Soils. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna partake in the beer drinking and the rib eating because I just brushed, mouthwashed, and flossed my teeth because I've never used dental floss before and I'm trying to get into that routine. Also, it means that if, when the guys are having the barbecue that obviously the beer does come out and they'll be drinking, which means tomorrow has given me an opportunity to get up early and do a workout in the morning and then I can focus in on the house. Alright, so we are just heading home from Prairie Soils and look what Matt did. He got jealous when he saw Parker's Jeep that the roof was off, so we are just heading home now. It is 7 o'clock and Matthew wants to go to bed. So we are leaving the party and going home. I also need food because I didn't eat any of the ribs. I did have ice cream cake but I was forced, so we're gonna head home. I went over. Damn it. Having a little bit of a change of plan, we are heading to Dan and Emma's right now because they've been trying to do some garden work for a while, or if you're Canadian, yard work, so we're gonna head round and they're having some mojitos. But I am yet to have tea because I didn't eat any of the ribs. I did have a bit of ice cream cake, but I didn't have any of the ribs or anything. I didn't drink anything because of the gym. But I might have a cheeky mojito. Yeah. To Dan and Emma's. It was supposed to rain today. Ugh. Oh, Canada, you're just...
just so beautiful. We have just got home. Matthew has just decided that he wants to spray the yard again or fertilize the yard again, so that's what he's doing. Nice evening, haven't seen Dan and Emma for a while because obviously Matthew's been working hard. We haven't gone out for breakfast in a while. Hopefully, next Sunday, Matthew might have it off, so we might go out for breakfast next Sunday, which would be nice. But yeah, good mojito. Dan makes really good drinks. Mm-mm-mm.